orgasm, <laughs> it would be like a temporary fix, you know, for a sexual craving, and then it will come again, seemingly, and come again, just like being hot, or being hungry, or being thirsty, or whatever. And that's the human condition, that's like the cycles of, of lack, and then something to meet that lack, you know, that, that provides some kind of satisfaction, whether it seems to be a physical satisfaction or a psychological satisfaction or both. Um, it's, it's that same kind of cycle. So, when the mind believes in lack, it's, it has this unconscious belief in lack, and, and you might say the whole purpose of mind training, the whole purpose of exposing, of looking where the emotions are, the charges, the contraction, the constrictions and everything, are all part of healing. And that the spirit meets the mind where it believes it's at. So, so sexuality is, is something that's not like cut off on the spiritual journey. As you journey towards wholeness, it's, it's more that, that as you focus on your mind training and you expose those beliefs in lack, then your whole perception of the world changes, your perception of the body changes, and what seems to be external attractions, uh, which really aren't external at all, uh, that you start to realize that they're all being generated in consciousness.